Hello guys, it's Wash Lad 2014 here. I'm still in America and I'm at my granddad's this time and uh, this is his washer and it's um it's what they call they call these compact in America while well, this is our normal size. So anyway this machine is Kenmore and these particular ones have were also branded GE and Frigidaire, hence the nickname for these, hence the nickname for these are um, Frigimores, and these are, these are Electrolux made. So anyway, we'll start with the, um, I'll, I'll do that in a bit. So we'll start with the panel, this is the wash and rinse temperature got hot or cold warm and cold and just you know cold and warm and then, then you've got cycle signal which basically when I've been here before um, this machine does like a big like buzz at the end of the cycle so you can either have it off or like all soft or loud and then you can have the option of an extra rinse. Yes, simply yes or no. And this is the this is the program dial. And then the cool thing about this is that it's an analog one, which I'll get to in a bit. So you've got delicates, hand washables, permanent press, and regular, and also a short pre-wash section. And plus, you can always sort of turn the analog to, you know, like the final spin section if you want to do just spin only. So yeah, this will. I'm now going to demonstrate the analog. I've managed to figure out how to open the drawer. This is the drawer, the detergent drawer. This is obviously where you put the main detergent and this is the liquid bleach section. And over here is the fabric softener section. Of course, let's have a little look here. Now we're gonna open up the door. And um, this is the this and the cool thing about this is that it was bought from Sears all these years ago. And um, obviously, I believe Sears aren't around anymore. So Sears is a, another blast from the past. And this is a little look at the inside of the drum. About the same size as a, as the as the electric drums in the UK and also the cool thing here is that this thing right here is a cascade fill which is where the water goes in when it fills now this is a sad thing because obviously these are tanks but if you listen to this the bearings have gone on this but to be fair this is I'd say this is about a 20 year old machine, which it's not bad. It's not bad at all, especially for all of these and for how long it's been been used for as well. And this has been on pretty much every day. So yeah, this has actually done quite good for itself. But hopefully um, he can, my granddad can get it repaired or or just replace it but either way it, if it does go it'll be sad to see this go so yeah overall i do think these machines are tanks these really do a good job and honestly if i lived in america i would get one of these in a heartbeat so yeah anyway i'm going to 
clue what I'm going to end the video here. This has been the Ken. Actually, this has been the Kenmore four one seven four zero four one two seven zero two. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys another time. Goodbye and take care.